My name is Mia Lane and I do paintings primarily. I like to paint with acrylics, I think is my main focus, and then I use oils as well, and I use watercolors. I do etchings and photography, so I do like to use a multitude of mediums. Right now, one of my main inspirations has been the swamp and the wetlands of Fish Lake right behind our house in Demarestville. It'll inspire me to do a painting and this uh, piece in particular um, called The Awakening is a piece that was inspired by just going out, photographing uh, these formations. Uh, they're often stumps just covered in moss and lichen. I just love the shape and all the, the uh, old roots, rotting roots that were oozing out of this uh, fantastic um, shape. And as I was looking at it, I thought, well, I have to get to know it better and really understand my subject. And um, along with photographing it, I went into the swamp with my, my paints. And I start off with doing a, a bit of a painting, a rough painting that just gets me understanding the subject and looking at it. But when I took this home and from this I was going to create a larger painting, and I looked at it and I could just see this lady coming out of it with all her, her hair and, and I think you can even see it there, the, the face and the, the breast and part of the, the, the chest there. And that really, I thought, wow, I, I love this lady. <laughs> she needs to come out. <laughs> she needs to be awakened. <laughs> when you're painting, you have too much time to think, so you start imagining this woman coming alive and becoming her own self. I really enjoy putting lots of little details. I don't start off thinking about, oh, I want all these details in this painting, but I start off with something that the shape and the form, the design, is good and strong. I should get it like a high when you, you come out of painting and creating. It's really hard work uh, a lot of the times. Sometimes when I know what I'm doing, I can just do it somewhat routinely, but I'm always challenging myself. I paint the animals and the nature that um, I live around and, and that inspire me. You spend a lot of time as an artist in a studio all by yourself and sometimes it's nice to just get out and celebrate all these things we've created and come together and that's what the studio tour is. It's a celebration and it's a big party.